That's the reason why, uh, okay, I don't know whether you get uh, advertisements on YouTube. What kind of ad advertisement you get from YouTube when you watch YouTube videos? My father uses YouTube videos, so I don't really get advertisements. Oh, okay, so never mind. So for me, so sometimes they like to talk about um, uh, selling selling stuff on uh, yeah, but Amazon. Shopee ads and yeah, so, uh, or selling things on uh, Amazon or other e-commerce yeah. website. And they talk about... Um, what kind of items you, you should sell on uh, the e-commerce website okay so from there probably it gives you an idea okay so we talk about let's say books mm. and uh, versus the calculators mm. so uh, let's say the calculators cost $25 I mean selling price is 25 so books uh, it really has a very big range for the price of a book but generally I think book, book, books can be $10 Usually to it's also 20 plus it yeah. depends depends I'm not talking about your this exercise book I'm talking about the really the, the real book then it's like $12 yeah uh, okay let's say $12 mm. okay so without knowing the so this is the selling price mm. okay mm. so let's say you you, you, you you sell 10 of them each so this you you collect hundred and twenty dollars from it. Mm. Then this one you collect two hundred and fifty dollars from mm. it. Okay? But now the funny thing is if you want to know about the profit out of this one and this one. Mm. You need to know the cost. Mm. Okay? So for calculator, I don't know. Okay, I really don't know. So for the the cost of a book I think will be quite cheap. Okay. Why? For a cheap price for, uh, uh no, price. no. Basically, like you just, you know, you know, um, you just need to print it out. Mm. You need to, you just need to print it out. So once you have the first uh, twenty soft copy. Oh. Mm -hmm. So you just print. Yeah. And then the cost of a book is actually the paper plus the ink, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Like let's say I ass just assume that I ask you to uh, print out all the exam papers so once you have the copy if you want to print it out it only costs you the paper and the ink right yeah of course you don't go, talk, go and talk about electricity <laughs> okay like oh i need to use my computer to print out so okay? that's quite insignificant okay <laughs> right and of course you don't talk about the manual cost you you use to right okay so <laughs> they don't talk about those so the the cost mainly is paper plus ink right yeah so for calculator i think the cost will be uh the components right yeah ah. and of course the components plus the assembly cost and then you know all those yeah. stuff so i will say the cost of a book will be much cheaper than the cost for the calculator yeah. Yeah. so in a way let's say the cost is only two dollars and then the calculator is like fifteen dollars oh no i end up with the same answer <laughs> but never mind about it let's say the cost is two so therefore the profit per, per book is actually ten dollars right so ten dollars times uh, ten of them, so you make hundred dollars out of it, right? Mm. So for the calculator, uh, the profit is ten dollars, so you ten of them is also hundred dollars. So can you see that when you have a sales of two two hundred fifty compared to sales of hundred and twenty, the 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 sales amount okay. okay calculator is bigger than the uh, books, but the profit might not be that way the profit can be the same okay so that's the why the reason that's the reason why this is impossible to tell because you need to know the cost in order to 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 know the profit okay so 